gonadoclax has been approved in other malignancies such as CLL, and it's been studying, you know, in multiple myeloma and other hematologic malignancies. And in acute myeloid leukemia, we know there is a high expression of BCL2. So there is a, a rationale why this uh, gonadoclax agent would work to provide some anti-leukemic effect. Um, and it, the initial studies was uh, looking at, you know, preclinical and early phase study was looking at patient population, which was more relaxed refractory. Um, and it did not produce such robust response. The response rate was in the range of about 20% or so. And, um, and therefore, you know, it was also being studied afterwards in early, so newly diagnosed patients in combination rather than monotherapy. And uh, based on that phase one data, this you know phase three study uh, was actually designed, and um, it, it 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 it's a game changer for this patient population, to be honest. 